Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a dewy skin products available in India. If you guys have been subscribed since a long time to my channel, you would know that I have done I think two of these similar videos in the past and they have been the most popular and the most viewed videos on my YouTube channel and you guys found it so helpful. I still get uh, comments on that particular video. So I thought it's time I should do another one because my makeup collection has has grown a lot and I think I still love that kind of dewy and glowy base and yes I have a lot more products now that I absolutely love for that dewy base also compared to a few years ago I think now the Indian market has so many more glowy and dewy skin products I think there are so many hydrating and glowy foundations available in the Indian market and so many illuminators as well and I have tons of products that I can share with you guys but I cannot possibly fit everything in one single video so I thought that we can do this video in two parts in today's video I'm gonna be sharing all of the glowy and dewy skin prep products and the primers and the foundations and concealers that I have they are not a lot but I have some of them that I can compile in today's video and in the second part I can share all of my favorite highlighters and some dewy blushes and cream blushes and all of those so stay tuned for the second part as well and before we begin today's video please make sure that you guys hit that red subscribe button for more beauty fashion and lifestyle related videos and now let's get right into the video so let's start with all of the skin prep products first I do still love all of the products that I've shared in the previous videos so I'm not gonna repeat those I'm gonna share um, some other new products that are available in the market I have two illuminators by illuminators I mean like moisturizer infused with a little bit of highlighter something like the max strobe cream I have two options right here the cheapest one is the Lacme Lumi cream if you want that strobe cream kind of an effect but you don't have that kind of budget uh, then I think this is something really great to start with I think this is such a great product this is literally priced at $2.99 and it is such a great product I never thought like two three years ago that you could actually get like something similar to a strobe cream at this price because I think back in the days there was nothing like the MAC strobe cream but now you do have a few options Lacme Lumi cream has a little bit of fragrance which some people might not like all Lacme products do have a lot of fragrance which I don't like but they have uh, this is again pink in color just like the MAC strobe cream in the shade pink light and it is so moisturizing you can easily just skip your moisturizer and just use this and you will get such a beautiful glow you can also use this on top of makeup before you have set your face with a powder and it just sits so beautifully it never shifts my foundation it has such beautiful reflexes uh, it is not shimmery or glittery in any way so it does not emphasize any sort of texture at least on my skin so yes this is like the cheapest illuminator that I, I have in my collection and it is equally great just like the other illuminators the second one that I have is by Gush Beauty it's their glow getter illuminating moisturizers you guys have been seeing this product back to back in all of my videos and I just cannot stop raving about this product it is so high quality so beautiful the closest dupe that I have for the matte strobe cream and this one also does the job of a primer it also has some UV protection in it so I think this is all in all such a great product the packaging is good this is much more I would say lightweight than the uh, Lacme Lumi cream and this is again pink in color you guys can see it but it does not uh, show up pink on your face it is a little bit more hydrating than the Lacme Lumi cream and it just feels more expensive than the Lacme one for sure and it is also not as cheap as the Lacme one this one is priced at 1200 if I'm not wrong I'm gonna leave all the links of the products in the description box below this is how it looks like again it has the most beautiful glow illuminators are literally undetectable on your skin and it looks like you're just glowing from within so this is like my current favorite illuminator and it is also a clean brand so it just makes it even more perfect the next product that I have is actually a facial oil and it's again by Lacme it's the Lacme absolute argan oil radiance 
and this is an overnight oil and serum and this is how it looks like it is technically a skincare product but i don't like to include facial oils in my skincare routine i think they really clog my pores so i love using this before doing my makeup and no matter what foundation you're using even if you're using a very matte heavy foundation and if you just use this on the base i think it will give you the most beautiful glow and radiance to your skin this just makes sure that your foundation concealer and powders everything just glides on really smoothly on the skin if you still haven't tried this product and i would highly recommend you guys to try it it will make sure that your makeup glides on really really smoothly i would not recommend this for people who have extremely oily skin because this is like an oil base so i think people with extremely oily skin would not like it that much i have really dry skin so i absolutely love this on my base then i have a hydrating primer this primer has been a favorite since over a year now and i still love it so so much it's by wet and wild it's their prime focus primer serum and this is how it looks like you guys can already see how much i love this primer i just have a very little bit of left this is the most hydrating the most glowiest primer that i've ever used and it's just beautiful full for dry skin even if you have normal skin i'm really sure you will love this primer i already have a backup of this primer uh this is how it looks like so if you purchase a new one i think the old one i purchased over a year ago and i still have this much left and this is something that i received um very recently from the brand and this is how it looks like you guys can see they both look a little bit different in color this one is like a light baby pink one and this is sort of like a dark peachy color but i have used them both and they both are really really same they don't have any difference maybe they just changed the color or the formulation a little bit i have no clue about that but the product is exactly same so if you purchase a new one it might look like this one but the product is same so when you look at the bottle up close you will see some shimmer particles and it might look like a liquid highlighter but trust me it is not a liquid highlighter this is literally a serum it's literally like a glowy serum and it is so undetectable on your skin uh, you really don't have to be scared about your skin texture showing or anything because it really doesn't do that you literally need 2 3 drops of this primer and it will give you the most glowiest base and it is also so hydrating this is genuinely like the best primer for dry skin this is how it looks like it really preps your skin you can literally skip illuminators and everything and just use this as a base and then go ahead with your foundation and it will glide on smoothly now talking about foundations i have three recommendations for you guys the first one is by k beauty it's the k beauty is hydrating foundations i absolutely love this foundation for my dry skin i like to mix these two shades this is the shade 145 n medium and 170 white tan i received these in pr so i don't have a perfect match in this foundation but i think my perfect shade would be 150 white tan if you're somewhere around a uh, nc42 and i think that shade would really suit you this foundation has hyaluronic acid in it and it is so hydrating and this foundation being hydrating it does not really emphasize anything on your skin in fact it gives you that very soft blurring kind of an effect and it's something that i love the most about the foundation it looks very soft very blurred out like a very like a veil of filter on your skin it's literally like that it's not at all heavy not at all cakey or anything it also provides light to medium coverage so if you are looking for a foundation like that then definitely go ahead and try this one i highly recommend it for normal to dry skin i have this foundation on my skin today and you guys can see that it does not it does not take away any glow underneath from the foundation it looks very dewy very beautiful like a soft filter like foundation the next one is by lamior and it's their dewy glow skin perfecting cream foundation i'm in the shade nutmeg and this is how it looks like it's a cream foundation it's a clean beauty brand um, which is amazing and this foundation is priced at 795 and this is my exact match this is genuinely a dewy foundation it is again the kind of foundation that would give you like a medium coverage don't expect extremely high coverage from this foundation if you try to build it can look cakey because this is a cream foundation so make sure that you're using a light layer of the foundation and even if you apply this foundation with a brush i think it will still look so dewy and so glowy on your skin if you're into 
cream foundations and you don't like like the hassle of a liquid foundation then definitely try the la mior one it is so so good next foundation is by flower beauty it's the light illusion foundation and you guys know this is my favorite foundation out of all and this one gives you such a beautiful radiant glowy finish and it is medium to full coverage you can build it up to full coverage is what i feel it is the most full coverage foundation out of all of the three so yes it has pretty good coverage my exact shade is medium uh, no my exact shade is tawny in this foundation and i think in india this is the darkest shade available which is pretty sad i think in the us they have so many shades in this foundation but they don't have it here in india so if you are somewhere around my skin tone go for this shade this one really matches me like skin i don't have any other foundation that matches me so well it literally looks like second skin this foundation looks very skin like it just melts into the skin i love the finish of it i don't think i own a foundation that looks more beautiful on my skin than this one looks lastly i have a concealer it's by wet and wild it's their photo focus concealer and i have the shade medium tawny this is not my exact shade match i thought it would be but it is a shade lighter and again they don't have a lot of shades in this concealer but if you are looking for a nice brightening concealer then definitely go ahead and try this one um i use this to brighten my under eyes and i think it looks so hydrating uh this is not one of those matte self setting high coverage concealer it is definitely not like that it has medium coverage and it just does not take that glow from your skin also i feel like it is the most hydrating concealer that i own it's not extremely full coverage i think it is somewhere between light to medium but it's a great drugstore hydrating concealer if you want to try so this is it for today's video so this is it for today's video i hope you guys found the video helpful if you have any questions then leave it in the comment section below i would definitely respond and you guys can find all of the product links in the description box below don't forget to check that out uh, please don't forget to hit that like button subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon beside it to get notified whenever i upload a new video and i will see you guys in my next video bye